Brad from Home Team Inspection. Tony sent us this email. He says he looked at a home this week for sale in Oldham County and noticed that the hill in the back of the house runs towards the house. He says it's pretty steep hill. And even though there is what looks like a dip between the house and the hill in a bad rainstorm, he's worried that water might be an issue. And he's wondering if he goes back for a second look, what problem should he be looking for? He may decide to move forward with an offer if he sees the problems that you mentioned are not a big deal. So, Give us a rundown for Tony's sake. Well, I mean, he's he's concerned about the right thing. Anytime you have what's called negative grade, anything that slopes towards the house can be a concern for water getting into uh, crawl space or basement or up over a slab. Thing that I'd be looking for, uh, one, I'd, I'd love to be out there on a rainy day. Uh, I mean, all the dry days we've had recently, it's going to be tough to see. But he can look for evidence of any uh, water staining uh, up against the house, too. Uh, oftentimes, you're going to see mud stains. You're going to see, you know, water marks. Yeah. You know, you may see them on the brick. You may see it on the uh, any of the, the foundation itself. You might see where mulch has been, uh, you know, pushed up. Uh, by water up against the house. Those, those would all be kind of some of the telltale signs that I would look for. But yeah, any any chance that you have to look at it uh, during rain would be best. But if not, I'm just going to look for clues that there might be stains or water has moved things about. Very good. Uh, a reminder that uh, we're going over a lot of stuff. You may have friends, family members who want to hear this show. We make that easy for you. Go to LouisvilleAnswers.com. That's a redirect to our video, ver video version of this on YouTube. Again, LouisvilleAnswers.com. And a reminder, if you want to hear what uh, sellers are saying about our Socolor team, we're really proud of the folks we talk to when we help. You can go to LouisvilleSellersTalk.com. That's LouisvilleSellersTalk.com. I have a couple of new interviews with some recent sellers up there. 